Have you ever paused to wonder if the chirping bird outside your window might be a distant relative of a terrifying T-Rex? Quite a thought, isn't it? Well, what if I told you that it's more than just a whimsical idea? Paleontologists have unearthed compelling evidence that our feathered friends today are indeed the descendants of these prehistoric giants. As we delve into this intriguing narrative, prepare to embark on a journey through time, tracing the evolutionary path from the dinosaur to the dove. Yes, you heard it right. That small, delicate creature perched on your garden tree shares a lineage with the mighty dinosaurs. Imagine a time, millions of years ago, when the Earth was ruled by creatures we now only see in fossils. This was the Mesozoic era, a time when dinosaurs in all their magnificent diversity roamed our planet. From the towering long-necked Brachiosaurus to the fearsome Tyrannosaurus rex, these prehistoric beasts reigned supreme. Yet, beneath the surface of this dominance, a profound transformation was taking place. Certain dinosaur species began to exhibit intriguing physical changes. One of the most significant of these changes was the appearance of feathers. Yes, feathers, but why? Well, the theories are varied. Some suggest it was for warmth, others for courtship displays, and some even propose they served as a means for better hunting or survival. Regardless of the initial reasons, these feathery adaptations set the stage for a dramatic evolutionary shift. As time passed, evolution worked its magic, gradually transforming scales into feathers, marking the first step towards the birth of birds. With feathers in the picture, the stage was set for the dawn of a new era, the era of birds. A fascinating time in our planet's history when dinosaurs began to evolve into creatures that bore a striking resemblance to our modern feathered friends. Enter Archaeopteryx, a creature that sat at this intriguing crossroads, a mix of both dinosaur and bird. With its teeth, tail, and wings, it was a creature unlike any other, a veritable chimera of the ancient world. Its existence provides compelling evidence of the transition from ground-dwelling dinosaurs to the aerial acrobats we know and admire today. Flight was a game-changer in this evolutionary tale. It opened up new habitats, new strategies for hunting and escaping predators, and ultimately, new paths for evolution to explore. It was a turning point that marked the beginning of a new age. Thus, from the ashes of the dinosaur age, birds took flight, marking a new chapter in the Book of Evolution. Fast forward to today, and you'll find the legacy of dinosaurs living on in every bird that graces our skies. Our feathered friends, from the smallest hummingbird to the majestic eagle, are the modern-day avatars of those colossal creatures that once ruled the Earth. The genetic blueprint of birds reveals a fascinating tale of evolution, linking them directly to their dinosaur ancestors. Scientists have discovered that birds inherited a number of traits from their prehistoric predecessors. For instance, the three-toed foot of a bird, perfect for gripping branches, mirrors the tridactyl foot of theropod dinosaurs. The wishbone, a symbol of good luck in many cultures, is another shared feature. This furcula played a crucial role in the flight mechanics of birds and the breathing of dinosaurs. In recent years, groundbreaking research has peeled back the layers of time to reveal even more genetic similarities. Through the study of ancient proteins preserved in dinosaur fossils, scientists have found striking resemblances in the collagen sequences of dinosaurs and birds. This evolutionary journey from dinosaurs to birds is nothing short of miraculous. It's a testament to the power of evolution, the artistry of nature that transforms scales into feathers, predators into songbirds. So next time you see a bird soaring high, remember it's not just a bird, but a living testament to the awe-inspiring story of evolution. A story where dinosaurs didn't vanish but evolved to sing the morning chorus.